everybody, Isaiah Colton here, and welcome to another episode of Sales and Marketing Secrets podcast. And today is a special episode for me because I have a big announcement to make for you all. Um, if you're watching this on video on YouTube or you're maybe seeing this video connected to our newsletter or whatever it may be, um, big announcement. I am officially stepping down as the CEO of Ren 360, or what a lot of you guys know is Real Estate Nexus. Big decision for me. <clears throat> um, so, to let you guys know, uh, and a lot of you know, a lot of you know me uh, because I'm very in the, in the trenches with training, and coaching with our clients, and constantly innovating the product, providing more value uh, for your dollar any way that I can. And um, in that process of of, uh, of going through that experience, uh, something amazing has happened. Um, two things. Um, but before I share those two things, I want to kind of give you the backstory on why this decision has been made and real estate nexus and where we are today. So um, in 2019, um, I made a decision to start up a digital marketing and consulting firm. And the goal uh, of that digital marketing consulting firm with Real Estate Nexus was to help agents focus on driving business from their database, um, generating new leads, and within that, building a brand, uh, building what I call a power brand, leveraging digital marketing, social media, video marketing, so on and so forth. And the product is, we've been innovating to that, um, and there's a lot of complexity of pulling that off, bringing a lot of systems together. And we started off actually bringing a lot of third-party tools together into one hub, into one dashboard, and making it so basically you could operate out of one dashboard um, the best that we could. And we had pretty amazing success. We went from uh, $1.2 million in sales the first year to uh, three, it was like $2.4 in sales the second year. And then in the third year, we did over $5.8 million in uh, recurring revenue and a total of $10 million in contracts. And so we experienced rapid growth of the course of the three years. And then in that process, we continued to innovate and a couple of things happened. One, uh, one thing that happened was, is we decided to acquire a company called the Markai. Um, a Markai basically is a digital platform that's kind of do-it-yourself digital marketing platform where you have everything in one space and you can automate your social media, you can launch Google ads, Facebook ads, um, you can go and create marketing flyers and you can use this feature called Easy Promote. <clears throat> and um, Easy Promote is a, a revolutionary tool that we're in the process of actually trying to trademark right now. Um, and we, through that acquisition uh, between our current clients and um, Amarkai, we ended up with about uh, between free users using the software and paid right around 7,000 users. <clears throat> and a lot of, uh, a lot of you know, the, the Amarkai tool had so much potential, we decided to, decided to actually bring it in as our core service offering. Uh, meaning like uh, outside of any of our professional services that we offer, um, you could get in, sign up to this this platform, do all of your marketing from one space. And we're going to continue to innovate that. And that's why we decided to uh, change a mark I to REN360. And REN360 is essentially the core of our digital marketing uh, and consulting firm now. And uh, along the way to try to get exposure to Real Estate Nexus, I, um, I had been doing some coaching and consulting within the Real Estate Nexus environment. And I've been doing challenges, I've been doing boot camps, and <clears throat> the coaching and training was so well received um, that I started getting very, very passionate about uh, coaching and training. I, I had about 11,000 11, agents go through uh, my boot camps and, or sorry, my challenges, my boot camps total um, as far as registration. And uh, again, just, it was just an amazing feeling to see the breakthroughs that people were having, the stories that came off of it, the, you know, um, all this, 
all those different things. And then what, what happened then a, a new vision for, for me personally was born. Um, and, uh, that was the passion and motivation to help other businesses scale. And, uh, where that passion comes from is that I've been able, I've had an opportunity to take a real estate business from doing 50, 60 transactions all the way up to doing 200 transactions. And then through a broker to broker referral program that we grew off of it over a thousand plus transactions a year. So I had an opportunity to build um, the residential real estate. And then I've had an opportunity to build um, a referral brokerage into an actual inside sales operation, an inside sales company that was essentially hiring a virtual assistant uh, to prospect your leads and built that up uh, to uh, over $15 million in sales in about five years, hitting the Inc. 500. And then my third project, which is <clears throat> the... Uh, digital marketing consulting firm, um, again, building that up to 10 million in contractual sales. And so I've been super convicted that I have a really, a really, really strong formula to be able to do this. And up until um, up until probably the next couple of months, um, I have been able to do that without any institutional funding, like meaning it all started with uh, an idea in my kitchen with two other guys and about $50,000 in my pocket. And uh, so I'm strongly convicted that I have a really good formula, a really good success formula or blueprint for people where if they're looking to go to six figures and can secure a strong six, six figure income, there's a specific blueprint for that. I call it the sales acceleration blueprint, right? And then once you've secured the the six figure or high six figure income now it's trying to figure out how to go to seven figures and i've been able to achieve that too and so i have a i've developed a really good blueprint um for you know agents loan officers and insurance or anyone really in the home service industries to be to be able to do that um to be able to go to that level um and Recently, over the past couple of years, um, I've understood the difference between building a business and wealth creation, where you do you start doing really well and you get up into the seven figures and even eight figures in your business, and now you start strategically investing, whether it through be through acquisition or whether it be through rental properties or. Uh, this, you know, like um, investing even more money outside of a, but you know, your regular budget in the stock market or crypto, all these, all these different ways, looking for ways to create revenue, sh revenue share opportunities, joint venture opportunities, and uh, what I would, and so that's a, what I call the wealth creation blueprint, and uh, and so I'm excited to be at that phase in my career. Um, and I'm excited to share that blueprint, so to speak, as I learn and grow that part uh, with my community as well. And <clears throat> make a long story short, those three phases, so to speak, uh, going from solo entrepreneur where you're working for the business and the business isn't working for you, and then getting to the point of wealth creation has changed my life uh, dramatically uh, in so many ways. And so what... Uh, so that's kind of the backstory of where we're at today, leading up to the decision of me stepping down as CEO of REN360. And the reason why I'm doing that is because I'm actually going to be launching um, another company underneath the REN umbrella called, um, called Growth CEO, Growth CEO. And that's going to help people walk through those three phases of becoming a sole entrepreneur to becoming a business owner, becoming a business owner to creating wealth. And I am super passionate and excited about it. Uh, we, I've gotten a lot of amazing feedback. I've gotten influencers that are involved in the project. I've had people offer me half a million, a million dollars, 
or more to be a part of it um, as a capital raise to really get it off the ground even faster. And so I'm really excited about it. And officially it's gonna launch sometime in September and October where I've had a, always had a coaching program through Isaiah Colton and company. And I've had that kind of been working in conjunction with the real estate nexus community. What I'm super excited about is what's going to happen with a growth CEO. And so that's why I'm decide, I decided to step down. And what, so what does that mean? Uh, what does that mean is that goes, that means that I'm still going to be involved as the, uh, as your business coach for anyone that's part of real estate nexus. So for those of you that we've developed a really good relationship uh, in the run 360 community, that relationship is going to, that bond's going to get even stronger uh, because it's going to help me focus on, on business growth activities for you. 